What's up guys, Classy Ham here, and today I'm hoping to bring in a new sort of content to my channel which is going to be focused on something that I am doing personally over the next couple of weeks or maybe a month or two in order to ease myself back into university for this year. Now I'm studying gameplay design and production, which basically means I make the gameplay side of video games. I'm a tech guy, not an art guy, so if you're after art videos or art streams, I'm not really your guy there. I can 3D model, but not to the standard of putting things into video games. But in this series, if the series takes off, I'm hoping to build a small puzzle game, a first person puzzle game, along the lines of 10 floors. If you haven't seen the Halo map, I'll put a link to a video from either Forge Labs or somebody else playing through this Halo map in the description. It's a small, short form puzzle game where the player has to go through 10 floors of a sort of building, each floor connected by lifts. And once they reach the top of the 10 floors, the game ends. They have to solve various puzzles on their way, interacting with different objects and yeah, solving puzzles, really. So I'm hoping to go through building the mechanics for a game like this. And hopefully I can teach you guys some things along the way. I'm no Unreal Engine 4 expert by any means. But I make a lot of rookie mistakes and then I figure out how to correct them. And for anyone in my shoes that could be a student or somebody that's teaching themselves with Unreal Engine 4, well, I hope you gain something from these videos. Now, I know these videos are very different to the standard content that I post on this channel on my Monday and Friday videos, which are generally gameplay commentaries or other game-related videos. Not so much game development, but playing games, enjoying games, talking about mechanics in games, problems games have. There's a lot of Halo content there. And I don't want this series to impact on that at all. So I may try and upload these on a Wednesday or something else that doesn't impact my normal schedule. But we'll see how it goes. If people enjoy this series as much as they enjoy my standard content, then I may reserve Mondays for, say, Development Mondays or something like that. I may post more frequently, I may post sparingly, depending on whether I'm tackling a really tough problem or not, because a really tough problem could take me a lot longer than I'd like it to. I've had this problem before with other projects, but having shelved a whole bunch of projects before, it's given me a lot of experience and scope as to what I can and cannot do. And I hope that with this small project, that I can finally finish a game. I mean, I finished a couple of prototype S games before, but hopefully with this one I can finish and then get into the fleshing out phase. And maybe later on in the series I can move into more of an art video, uh, an art series, and get a bit better and improve with my 3D art. Thank you very much for watching this sort of episode zero for this new series that I plan to do. If you are excited to see the new series and can't wait to see me actually work on a tangible game project rather than just some little prototypes in UE4 explaining how uh, Halo shooting mechanics are a bit naff, then please leave a like or a comment. And remember, stay classy.